These trucks were out and about all around the five boroughs yesterday, parked here in Gowanus tonight, uh, and that's because they did most of that job last night. You can see the blacktop here behind me, and also one thing you should be looking for is all this salt because the job is not done just yet. They have uh, uh, some salt spreaders that are still going around earlier tonight. We saw a front loader filled with salt that was spreading them throughout the streets, all to make sure that it is a safe morning commute for everyone but for the most part the five boroughs were in good shape earlier today around the five boroughs we did hear about a couple power outages however at last check con ed was only dealing with about 1200 customers throughout the five boroughs who were still without power the biggest complaint from people seemed to be that their internet was out or uh disconnecting from time to time but all that seems to be up and running which of course is good for remote learning which will be going on for so many new york city school students so with all that said, the biggest headache seemed to be good old fashioned digging out your car. But New Yorkers we spoke to say, hey, we're used to that by now. I grew up doing it, you know, that's what my, you know, parents told me. So He'd been shoveling his whole life. <laughs> that's a good thing, man. That's you know, a good so thing. Like, yeah, it's not bad. It wasn't that bad. You know, I'm used to it. It happens every year. I think around. they did a really good job. Yeah, I mean, I'm usually, I go upstate a lot, so this is like nothing compared to what we get up there. But um, yeah, they did a good job. I think they did fine. Yeah, and of course, some of the snow totals, not what we were expecting, at least not on the higher end of those totals. In this area in Brooklyn, they were saying about six inches uh, for the most part. Some areas in Manhattan seeing 10 inches. But the key tomorrow as you head to school and work, of course, is to make sure you leave yourself plenty of time. Watch out for that black ice. We don't need any accidents slowing us down. So be safe out there in the morning. For now, reporting live from Gowanus, Joe Masiri, Pix11 News.